Alright, hi everybody. In this video, we're going to learn how to rotate sprites using the rotation property. I have this snake sprite. I can press up, down, left, right, and the head of the snake. The head of the snake, no matter what arrow key I press. So let's see uh, what the code does here. So global variables, constant speed equals 5. So the sprite moves 5 pixels at a time, up, down, left, right. And the preload function, just loading the images into the variable snake and M. And then the setup function will run. Uh, uh, creating a canvas, creating a sprite at the middle of the screen with divided by two, height divided by two, and it's 100 pixels wide and 100 pixels high. Then I'm adding the animation from snake and nim, and I'm calling it moving. Now the function key pressed. So this is where we're going to change the rotation property at the beginning here. So I'm stopping the animation of the snake. The only way the snake animation is playing is if it, one of the four arrow keys is pressed down. If the up arrow key is pressed, I'm changing the Y position by minus speed. So it's going uh, up. The Y value increases as you go down. And I'm changing the rotation of the snake sprite to minus 90 degrees. So what does that mean? The right hand side of the canvas is zero degrees. So if I wanted to move up, I need it to point to the top, which is minus 90, right? It's a right angle from the middle of the screen to the top and to the right. So I'm changing it to minus 90 degrees and then the snake animation will play. If it's not that, then I'm checking for the down arrow. And if that is held down, then I'm changing the Y position by five and adding five and I'm setting the rotation property of the snake sprite to 90 degrees, right? If it's if I'm going down and the right hand side is zero, that is plus 90. Clockwise is positive. Anti-clockwise is negative from zero. Uh, the left arrow, so in the left arrow is pressed. I'm changing the X by minus speed. The X is getting smaller and I'm setting the rotation to 180, right? That's the right hand side is zero. One, end, one right angle is 90 plus another right angle is 180. So I'm setting it to 180 degrees and playing the animation. And if it's the right arrow, I'm adding speed to X. So it's increasing by five and I'm setting the rotation property of the snake's right to zero because zero is the right hand side of the screen. And in the draw function, just a normal draw function, drawing the background, running this key pressed function and drawing the sprite. So that's how you can rotate the sprite using the rotation property. Set the rotation to whatever angle you want when a certain event happens.